Hello everyone's everyone's. I am here for my review of Married to Medicine Season 9 Episode 14. If you are new to my channel, welcome. I am Lady T. I like to do reviews on scripted reality shows, reality shows, and also the reactions. If you're returning, you're one of my peoples, oh, welcome back. So we don't have any comments from last week's video, so we're going to jump right on in. Eugene, he didn't make nice, good lasagna. People was eating. Everybody's having a good old time. But Anila, she's telling the ladies how that the police are investigating the robbery and that she has hired a private investigator. And not only that, that she also is going to take a polygraph test to prove that she had nothing to do with it. And they're like, why would you be taking this polygraph test? We said, because there's people out here that think that me and my husband were behind this. Are we acting like we got robbed for insurance reasons? So she just wants to know which one of y'all thinks this was a setup. Toya says she don't know. Um, she said, I don't know what you would do. I don't know you. Now I'm like, you don't know her? This is the same thing Toya did about Zayna. I don't know you. I don't know you. You and Anila been on this show together for two years. I'm, if I'm not mistaken, she was the friend that brought Anila on. But now you're talking about you don't know her? I'm like, what are we doing, Toya? So it's like, we, let's just move on past this conversation. But Quarrel's like, no, man, we're going to sit right here and hear what Anila got to say. Why are you so quick to want to move on from this conversation, Toya? What's, what's going on? And now you're talking about you don't know this girl and you ready to hop, skip, and jump past this conversation. And I was like, you know what? I understand, too. But then I also understand she's mad because Anila was out here putting, you know, brought somebody to a party who said that she was sleeping with everybody in the neighborhood. When our actuality... It was Heavenly that did that. Now, I don't know if it was a Heavenly did that to, I want to give you a heads up because we friends. Or it is, I heard about this rumor and I'm going to be the one to do that to you because I'm mad at you for whatever reason right now. It could have been that. I don't know. But Jack is like, uh-uh. There would be no fun until we clear the air on things. I'm like, Jackie, you... You regulating when people can and can't have fun? Mm-mm. Like, Toya is mad at at least three people here. She mad at Audra because Audra put her business out here in the streets and chest bumped her. She's mad at Neela because, one, Anila and Karen, Dr. Kieran, um made fun of them and they Halloween costume about moving all the time. And then... She brought somebody to a party who put a rumor out there, started a rumor, or spread the rumor that she was sleeping with somebody in the neighborhood. Well, when Anila nor Dr. Gonzaga did that, she made it quiet. They've been going back and forth with each other all these years. It's like, she made it these three people, and you expect, okay, we're going to sit together. Y'all, each person you made it, y'all going to come together and do some kumbaya and all that stuff, and then we can start having fun? Like, I'm, I mean, I be wanting to be a peaceful per person, but I can also not care for you like that, and you can be in the same room with me, and I can still have fun. You be over there doing what you're doing, as long as it, your, my name ain't in your mouth. We cool. You sit over there and do what you got to do. Everything going to be fine. Audra wants to know, wh why, what is this going on between me and you? Because it is not that serious. Yes, you talked about my you know, wardrobe and all that other stuff. But like, where is this hostility coming from? It does have a little bit to do that you, you know, spread her business like that. But like, I was confused, y'all. Because... Toya, she was like, her altercation with Mariah, which is like eight, nine years ago. I'm trying to figure out what did it have to do with her beef with Audrey. Because she's crying, talking about some, I just had my son a year ago. And I was over here fighting Mariah. And I know people was looking at me like, Eugene don't need no wife like that that's out here fighting. And she is a bad mama because she out here fighting. I'm like, what does that have to do with you and, uh, you and Audrey getting into it? I was confused. I rewound several times to try to figure out what happened and I don't know if I didn't rewind enough but I'm gonna need y'all to go down in that comments co comment section below 
and explain to me why was she crying about the fight she had with Mariah, which was like eight, nine years ago. I was so confused. Didn't know what was going on. Now, this is... I like Martin, Dr. Martin and Audrey because these two, they crack me up. She is sitting in a room talking about some, oh my goodness, my boobs feel kind of sore and tight. He's like, I know milk ain't in there yet. I was like, girl, you like freshly pregnant. Like, you just found out. Now, you probably knew before you took that test, but you wanted to take a test on TV. I understand that. But you, you not into where... Your boobs should be sore because you're pregnant. She talked about, oh, I feel like I got a baby bump. He was like, yeah, you do look like you about 10 minutes pregnant. And I'm cracking up because he's like, girl, you freshly pregnant. That That's not no, that's not no baby bump. That's that lasagna you ate last night because it was that good because you went for two plates. He didn't say that, but he was like, yeah, you do look like you about 10 minutes pregnant. Like, girl, really? I like these two. So, the man they go bowling, which Eugene, I guess this is what Eugene does in his spare time. He likes to go bowling. He has his own bowling ball. He has his own bowling shoes. He be hitting them doggone strikes all the time. This is just what this man does. And his team won because he was hitting them strikes like that. The ladies, they had a little spa situation going on. I was like, okay, I would love to go to a spa but my paranoia will not let me do that because I know it was like that when I first moved to Houston. That like a lot of spa places were getting raided. And I was like, I don't want to be going to one thinking that it's a, a, a reputable establishment. And then I find out that you're out here doing this, that, and the third. Y'all, my husband is watching something on his phone. And I can almost guarantee you it is something that he didn't watch several times. But he is laughing like he has never seen it before in his life. So if you hear some laughing in the background, that's just husband over there laughing. Toya wants to know why Anila would bring Zayn to the party if she knew she was around here starting the rumors. Anila lets her know. I Zayna called me a few days before the party and said, hey, Quad invited me. Can I ride with you? And she was like, sure. And like she said, Quad told her she could bring a friend. And now, this is when I had the side eye of Anila because they showed Anila and Zayna talking at Quad's party. And she was like, I'm going to need your help. And she's like, girl, yeah, sure. What you need? We're going to talk about this rumor. So, it looks like they had every intention of doing it. They just didn't get a chance to. So, y'all wrong because that was your... That was your whole intent of doing to get on there and spray her with this rumor for whatever reason. It's just that y'all didn't get a chance to do that because Heavenly beat y'all to the punch. Now again, I don't know this was Heavenly did that because she wanted to um, warn Toya that they was going to spray her with this rumor. Or is it she wanted to be the one to bring up the rumor so she can get things started like I'm going to do this is I'm being there for you but I'm really doing this because I want to get you mad because y'all had that intervention against me and I'm still mad about that I'm not really sure but the thing is Anila you was going to do it you just didn't get a chance to so now I'm looking at you sideways like, what are we doing, Anila? Why are you so mad and wanting to spray Toya with this information that's, that's been going around in the neighborhood? Yeah. yeah. Just over there, just laughing away, y'all. Don't care that I'm doing a video at all. Child, what, that was basically, they happened... Contessa, she's down there getting her feet rubbed by Dr. Jackie and Toya and the husbands walk in like, girl, what, like, what is going on here? It was a lot. But, yeah. How y'all feel about that Anila was going to do it? Heaven, Dr. Heavenly was right. But it's just that Anila, even though she was going to do it, she didn't do it. She wasn't the one who brought it up. 
but she was going to do it. So, yeah, I'm looking at you sideways, girl. So, y'all, that was the gist. If I love anything, y'all, follow me. Leave a comment below. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Feel free to subscribe. It's free all day, every day, for $3.99. Make sure your notifications are on. So, my beautiful Facebook video, you can click on it. You can like it and share it with your people. And you can come over and be one of my people. If you're in one of my peoples, oh, welcome back. Y'all know what to do. Tell your people to tell their people to come over and be one of my peoples by clicking that icon above. This is Lady T signing off. Have a good one.